Hi everyone, my name is Janice, and this is my first demo video for the 2018 spring semester with Review Board. My project is to refactor SCM tool registration. Because this is mostly an architectural project, I drew out a rough diagram of my end goal here. Basically, on startup, we would like the SCM tools to be registered via a registry rather than directly in the database, as they are now, because it is more flexible and allows users to define their own tools and register them at runtime. In the first week, I created an API in service.py to register an SEM tool, unregister, and get an SEM tool by its name. And then I created some unit tests for this API in test registration.py, where I have four functions, one to test registration, test unregistering, uh, also one to make sure that an item lookup error occurs if the tool does not exist in the registry, and one last test to get a registered tool by its name. So now if I run this test, it should pass. And voila! So the next step was to make modifications to the repository model so that migration to the registry is possible. We would like to create a new tool model which can take a tool class and point the existing attributes from the old model, now called legacy tool. I made modifications to the repository so it has a SCM tool name field, and the old tool, tool field is now called legacy tool. So here I have my new, new tool model, the legacy tool model, these two field modifications to repository. And what I would like to do is that when the repository tries to get an SCM tool, it first checks if the legacy tool is attached. And if it is, then to set it to none and get the SCM tool class by the SCM tool name and return an instance of the new tool model with that class. And for these modifications to the repository model, I had to create a new evolution here where I rename the tool field to legacy tool, change the field and add the SCM tool name. And that is the end of my demo. Thank you for watching.